Once upon a time, in a small village nestled in the countryside, there lived a young shepherd named Liam. He had spent his entire life taking care of the family's flock of sheep, following in his father's footsteps. While the other children his age went off to school, Liam reveled in the open fields, finding solace in the simple joys of nature. One sunny morning, Liam's mother approached him with a beaming smile and said, Liam, my dear, it's time for you to go to school and learn all the wonderful things the world has to offer. Confused and hesitant, Liam replied, But mother, I'm happy just being here with our sheep. Why must I go to school? His mother gently explained, School is where you can learn new skills, meet new friends, and discover your ambitions. It's important to have dreams and goals for the future. With a heavy heart, Liam reluctantly agreed and embarked on his first day of school. As he entered the classroom, he observed his classmates eagerly discussing their aspirations and dreams of becoming doctors, engineers, and artists. The concept of ambition puzzled Liam. He couldn't understand why everyone around him was so consumed with chasing distant goals, while he found contentment in the present, tending to the sheep, and enjoying the tranquil beauty of nature. Day after day, Liam listened attentively to the lessons taught by his teacher, Miss Anderson. She spoke passionately about the wonders of the world, the importance of setting goals, and the pursuit of success. Liam couldn't help but feel a sense of unease, as if his simple life with the sheep was being undermined. One afternoon during a break from class, Liam confided in his friend Sarah, who dreamed of becoming a famous painter. Sarah, I'm struggling to understand why everyone is so focused on ambition and success. I find joy in the present, surrounded by nature and the sheep. Is there something wrong with me? Sarah smiled warmly and replied, Liam, there's nothing wrong with finding happiness in the present moment. Ambition is different for everyone. Some seek external achievements, while others find fulfillment within. If you're content with your life, embrace it, and don't let societal pressures dictate your path. Liam pondered Sarah's words and began to question the need for a predetermined future. He realized that he was content with the peaceful rhythm of his life, the connection he felt with the sheep, and the beauty of the natural world. As the years went by, Liam continued to attend school, but remained rooted in his appreciation for the present. While his classmates chased their ambitions, he cultivated a deep understanding of the land, animals, and the serenity they brought to his life. Eventually, Liam's unique perspective caught the attention of his teacher, Miss Anderson. She recognized his profound connection with nature and encouraged him to share his insights through art and storytelling. Liam discovered a new passion for expressing the beauty and simplicity of his surroundings, bringing joy and inspiration to those around him. In time, the village began to see the value in Liam's perspective. They realized that fulfillment could be found in the present, not just in distant goals. Liam's artwork and stories touched the hearts of many, reminding them to embrace the beauty of the moment and appreciate the simplicity of life. And so, Liam's journey became a testament to the importance of finding contentment in the present, cherishing the joys of the everyday, and embracing a path that resonates with one's true self. His story served as a gentle reminder that ambition is a personal choice, and that happiness can be found wherever the heart feels most at peace. You see in life as you lived, True fulfillment lies in embracing the present and finding contentment in the simplicity of life, rather than constantly chasing distant goals and succumbing to societal pressures. Thank you for watching This is Believe and Achieve Stories. If this story adds a little value to your life, then make sure you subscribe to Believe and Achieve until then, stay focused.